Good morning. Welcome back to 10 Tampa Bay this morning. We're your hurricane headquarters. I'm meteorologist Amanda Pappas here to keep you calm all throughout hurricane season and up to date and prepared and connected. We do have an area in the tropics that I'm watching right now. It has a 70% high chance for development over the next week. Over the next two days, we're good to go. Nothing's going to develop quite yet. However, here's what I'm seeing in our in-house model. We could see down in the Caribbean, just near Jamaica, heading into this late week. I'm talking to you Thursday, Friday. We could have a tropical depression or tropical system form, right? So it's going to stay down in the Caribbean for quite some time. High pressure is our bestie throughout this week and even into early next week. So we do see that this is Sunday. Now we could have that tropical system in the Caribbean, right? As we go throughout this week into early next week, the high pressure is going to be over our area and keep the system down in the Caribbean. Now, there's a chance this could not form at all still, so keep that in mind. But if something were to form in the Caribbean, it would not even impact us until late next week. I'm talking heading into November 20th, November 21st. That's when that high pressure moves away, and we could potentially see a tropical system impact us here. But the model showing us that it would be a weak system overall, Still a lot of time for change. I'm not telling you to not worry at all, but I'm telling you it's too early to worry. This potentially could impact South Florida.